hello guys uh, in this tutorial uh, we'll discuss uh, how we can import uh, rss feed xml data uh, in our wordpress website as a post you can see uh, there are multiple things that we can get rss feed xml data and we need to move all these rss feeds data to our wordpress post we can move th these to the um, custom post type as well and also wordpress default post type called post so let's uh, do that so here you can see this is our wordpress post there are empty okay uh, you can see no posts found over there right now so we are going to add multiple posts using a third party rss feeds url so you can uh, yeah this is something xml url uh, feeds url okay i will share these things to, um, to the description uh, so let's do that in that case we need to add a plugin called wp tmatic so let's install this plugin first so go to the plugin okay and search wp tmatic so yeah you can see uh, this plugin the first one wp tmatic rss feeds feature just install this plugin first okay yeah and activate the plugin now you can see the plugin has been activated let's go to the plugin section in the left sidebar you can see the option for wpe matico so we need to cl um, click on add new button so let's click on add new button first and just click add a new title called something like these rss feeds post okay whatever you need you can and now we need to now we can uh, yeah, now we can uh, get this link just copy this rss feed links copy and i will share this link uh, in the description you can you can fetch this url and as a as a testing purposes you can test so for now i'm just copy this xml url and go to the plugin section okay and you can see i'm going to add new rss feed post then just click on add feed option and paste it over there the link xml link okay i'm just pasted the link over there and click on check check mark okay now you can see uh, it's already fetched url has been fetched we need to set up this configure something like this we, so uh, how many articles you would like to fetch actually for now i am going to add 1000 so if there are 1000 posts in the xml file xml link all post will be fetched automatically okay and you can configure something like this and post link to the resources whatever if you like to um, redirect to the link i mean the parma link to the post title link you can otherwise you can uncheck this so as of now i'm just clicking this um, checkbox and we need to start your your con job so this is the schedule for cron okay just uh, every six hours that's fine and go to the right side where you can see the multiple post type where you want to add move this post actually move this uh, xml post to the specific post type you can see uh, you can select for our services post type you can select for news you can select for events so as of now i would like to um, move the posts from xml data to the wordpress default post so as a default it always selected for post so let's do that and click on publish button okay so once you click on publish button just scroll down and you can run you can all run this once okay you can see it looks like running and then go to your all campaign option again okay you can see the nine post has been fetched okay so these nine posts should be moved to the wordpress default post type called post so just click on post so here you can see the nine post has been added into our wordpress default post type and these all 
दिस ऑल आर कमिंग फ्रॉम द एक्स एम एल यू आर एल एक्स एम एल फीड्स यू आर एल सो वेन एवर फीड्स यू आर एल अपडेटेड इट विल ऑटोमेटिकली अपडेटेड इन दिस पोस्ट टाइप एक्चुअली सो एज ऑफ नाउ कैन सी इन द फीड्स यू आर एल देर आर आई थिंक नाइन पोस्ट ओवर देयर सो यू कैन सी ओनली नाइन पोस्ट वंस इट्स अपडेटेड वंस इट्स अपडेटेड टू टेन ट्वेंटी एंड थर्टी पोस्ट इट विल ऑटोमेटिकली एडेड ओवर देयर सो दिस इज समथिंग वी कैन इजिली इम्पोर्ट आर एस एस फीड्स एक्स एम एल डेटा इन अवर वर्क प्लेस वेबसाइट एज ए पोस्ट ओके थैंक यू